five years maybe with a child i don't know how is your mental bro like oh my that just gave me like flashbacks fuzzy and warm inside because i'm like oh my god like y'all fuck with me it's, it's just ill like i like it's weird like i Hi guys, welcome, welcome back to my channel. If you've been here before, hi. If this is your first time, hi, thank you for my channel. So today's video, as you guys see from the title, I'm gonna be doing a QA and a video for you guys. So I have not done a Q&A video on my channel before, I don't think so, like, or recently. But I asked on Instagram for you guys to ask me some questions and I got some questions. Some of them I'm not gonna answer because y'all are bugging. And then some we're just gonna go through and then answer them to give you guys what y'all got. I don't know. But yeah, let's get started. The first question that I have is do you enjoy filming makeup tutorials more or vlogs? I feel like I enjoy filming vlogs more because it shows more of my personality. Like makeup tutorials, that's like, you know, that's regular content. Like you guys see my skills all the time. But I feel like just vlogs just show my personality. And that's really what I'm trying to show more of on my TikToks or on my YouTube. So yeah. But if you want to see more makeup content, go to my TikTok, though. So. Yeah, shameless plug. Um, the next question that I have is, where do you see yourself in five years? Five years, hopefully married, okay? Five years, maybe with a child, I don't know. Um, <laughs> but I definitely want to be done with school, working as a nurse. But yeah, so in five years, I definitely want to be settled down, um, working as a nurse, Maybe like having a makeup business on the side, but yeah, I definitely I have a lot planned for five years from now. I promise you guys, just 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 watch, yeah, just yeah, just watch, just watch. The next question that I have is, would you move? If so, where? I would definitely move. I just don't know exactly where. I know for a fact that I don't want to be in New York my whole life. Like that's just something that I don't want to do. I don't have an exact location as to where I want to move to, but I definitely do want to move. The next question that I have is favorite coworker. I'm not gonna disclose that, but you know who you are. I have a lot. I have a few favorite coworkers, or like people just that just make working easier than it it is. You know what I mean? Just easier. But yeah, yeah. This thing that I have is: Do I have any hobbies? Yes, I crochet, I paint, makeup is also a hobby. Um, I feel like vlogging or like YouTube is also like a hobby of mine. Um, what you want to call it? Content creating. I feel like it's also a hobby, a passion, something that I want to do long term. Um, yeah, anything just like art related, anything like crafty music. Um, yeah, I just love art. I love art. Um, the next thing that I have is how is your mental? My mental health is great. Like, for the first time in like a long time, my mental health is actually great. Like, it's so, like, it's good. The next question that I have is, are you planning on, oh my god, this question is funny. Oh my god, are you planning on selling jewelry again? I love your bangles. Thank you so much. But no, bro. Like, oh my, that just gave me like flashbacks to my business. I love my business so much, but I feel like at the moment, I don't think I'm going to start back up anytime soon because I do have a lot of things that I also want to do. I feel like that's something that I wanted to experience and I definitely did and I learned a lot. Would I do it in the future? Maybe, maybe. But as for right now, it's definitely not something I have planned for like any moment. But thank you so much for the support. That 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 made me smile. That made me happy. This question that I have is favorite favorite travel destination. I can't answer that question because I've only been to two other countries apart from like America, and they're not my favorite. I feel like I would definitely find a favorite in the future. So that question is still waiting for an answer. But you guys will be here with me when I find that place. I promise you. Uh, what is your dream job? My dream job, nurse. I want to be a NICU nurse. Like, oh my god, I want to be a baby nurse. Oh my, I want to be a NICU nurse so bad. But on the side, I also want to be a makeup artist. So I don't know how that's going to work, but we will make it work. We're going to make it work. Also, like a content creator. I don't know how about, I don't know about that part, but definitely content creator slash makeup artist slash NICU nurse. Like, that's me. That's me. I'm going to do all of it. Watch. Um, The next question that I have is where do i go to school i'm not gonna disclose that but i go to a cuny school in new york city that's all i gotta say that's all i'm gonna say um the next question is how is youtube going youtube is going great youtube is actually going great like i've gained so much support from like strangers 
or like people that I don't know and it just makes me feel all fuzzy and warm inside because I'm like oh my god like y'all fuck with me I'm like y'all fuck with me like I love that but like, YouTube is going great consistency I've been consistent and it's definitely paying off okay and yeah like you yeah yeah and I'm also getting better with editing and like making like you know, I'm just, like, I feel like I've always been good with, like, editing, but I'm definitely getting better, and I'm learning new things, new skills, new, like, you know what I mean? But, yeah. The question is, how did you learn to do makeup, and how long did it take you? I don't really remember how I learned. I feel like it was just practice, honestly, like, just practice, practice, practice. I've been doing makeup since I was in, like, sixth grade. So, I used to steal my mom's makeup, do, like, just look crazy around the house, and it was always something that I was passionate about, so I just kept practicing and practicing and practicing, and, that, and as that, I... I and as I got older, I just bought my own makeup stuff and then I just kept practicing and practicing and practicing and now look at me. You know what I mean? Now look at us. But honestly, all I gotta say is it takes practice. And like I said, I started in sixth grade. I'm a sophomore in college now, so I don't know what that time frame is, but it's been a minute, okay? It's been a while, it's been a while. The next question I have is if you could travel anywhere, where would you go? There's so many places I wanna go, but one of the places that I wanna go to is Saudi. Like I wanna go to Saudi so like you guys have no idea how bad i want to go to saudi if i have money if i ask somebody to sponsor me to saudi today i would quit my job and go to saudi today like that's how bad i want to go to saudi like there's also like obviously there's other places that i want to travel to i want to see but saudi is like she's that girl like she's that girl like obviously there's like religious reasons as to why i want to go but i also just want to explore the country as it is but yeah um the next person that i have is Y'all are so cute. Oh my god. I'm sorry. I'm reading some of these questions and y'all making me emotional. Because what the fuck? What is your major in college? My major in college is nursing. I'm a nurse. Um, an RN. That was That's like my end goal. But probably when I'm done, I'll probably like do other courses to become like a NICU nurse. Because that's like my main goal. Goal for referral, for real. Yeah, NICU nurse. Um, the next question is, any advice on some... Any advice to someone who wants to do makeup? All I gotta say is practice 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 like practice will be your best friend like bro and also don't give up because it could definitely be discouraging like when you do your makeup and you don't like the way it looks you could be discouraged but all i gotta say is don't give up like practice and also do not go out and buy like high-end products when you're beginning even i feel like even when you've like developed your skill do not go out and buy high-end products because you're gonna be wasting money and yeah, a lot of affordable products do a lot of good things. Like, my face right now, the only thing that's expensive in my whole beat right now is my foundation. And it's the fancy foundation. So, it's like, don't really, like, go out and buy, like, Huda Beauty products. Even though they are good, like, I've heard they're really, really good. I don't own it, so I can't really attest to that. But I know they're really, really good. But the ones that I've been using, my Maybelline, she's never disappointed me. Or my Makeup Revolution, they've never disappointed me. And they're very affordable. So I would say start off very, like, you know, drugstore. Because drugstore products are good. I don't know why people are shit. People be shitting on drugstore products. But drugstore products are good. So I will just, like, you know, get you some drugstore products. Some brushes from um, Shop Miss A. Some elf brushes are really, really good. Elf brushes are great quality. Do that. And then, yeah, you'll be set the next question that i have is what is your number one goal right now my number one goal honestly is just to register for classes because it's stressing me it's stressing me out like registering for classes is stressing me out so that's my goal like at the moment right now right now right now register for classes get my schedule done and then like figure out whatever i'm gonna do afterwards but yeah like in the moment that's all my mind is focused on right now is to get my school schedule and get everything for school together like together because it's stressing me out it's stressing me out um, the next question that I have is any advice for high school or college freshmen? I have a video on that coming out soon. I actually just finished filming that video before this one. So it's definitely going to be coming out as a part of my back to school series of videos. So you guys should just like stay tuned for that. Yeah. Yeah. It might be out before this video is. I don't really know yet, but yeah, go check it out. The next question that I have is what is something you've learned slash noticed after losing weight? Ooh. Ooh. Whoever asked, who asked this? Yeah okay i i yeah but bro i've learned a lot i've noticed a lot i've experienced a lot like attention wise it's just so weird like you get more attention now from people like it's so weird you get more compliments from people now it's so weird like 
it's just weird like obviously like your clothes fit better like you get shot you get to shop more i feel like personally i just love shopping regardless so like you get to shop more like you get cuter clothes you know like you just you could go into it like i feel like now i could just go into a store and not be worried if they're gonna have my size or not because like their store will carry my size you know what i mean so like i'm not worried about that anymore like my mental health is better my self-esteem is better like if you guys used to watch me before like you could tell my self-esteem and my confidence is definitely better now than it was before like i said people treat you differently like friends niggas like it's like it's so weird like i get more attention now from men from men that i did before and i don't like that like it's it's just ill like i like it's weird like i literally i was just talking about this i was just talking about this like a few like weeks ago with like a few people because i'm like it's literally so weird and i hate it but yeah um the next question that i have is what do you use to form an edit i use my phone either this one that i'm using which is an 11 Pro Max, which is like my regular phone, or this phone, which is a 14, if I'm not mistaken. Um, yeah, yeah, I think this is a 14. I don't know, but yeah, I use I use them. I just rotate back and forth depending on like which one, like or what I'm doing at the moment. But yeah, the next question that I have is, can you make a video on how you edit? I would try. I would try. I don't really know because I film on my phone. Like, I film on this phone a lot of the times. And I edit on this one a lot of the times. So, I can't really, like... You know what I mean? Like, I'm trying to... I don't know how I'm going to do it. I don't really know how I'm going to do it unless I do, like, a screen recording type video. But I don't know. Like, right now, I'm in the process of getting an iPad for school slash, like, YouTube. So, if I do end up getting that, I'm going to do a video on how I edit showing you guys everything. But, yeah um what else do i have to answer for you guys i think that's it the next question that i have for you guys is gonna be how was life somebody asked me how was life alhamdulillah alhamdulillah life is great right like life is oh my god like i don't know how to explain it life is amazing right now like yo like, even with the stresses that i have life is still amazing like it's so like i don't know but it's so yeah all i gotta say is alhamdulillah life is amazing like that's all i can say because y'all don't understand like y'all don't understand because there's so much things i don't share with you guys but yeah life is life is life like life is yeah and that's what i know is what do, do you love me i love you i love you you know who you are if you ask this question you know who you are love you i miss you but yeah that's what i have for you guys don't forget to, uh yeah that's all i have for you guys today don't forget to like and subscribe and let me know what other videos you guys want to see um like i said my back to school content or my back to school series is going to be starting up soon so subscribe to stay tuned for that video but yeah thank you guys so much for watching bye and also thank you for everybody that asked a question if you're gonna ask a question i'm watching you